let's go to Matthew chapter 5, verse 7. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Let me ask you this. Are you going through any problems right now? If you are, are you praying to God to help you in whatever situation that you are in now? Are you? Are you looking for God to show you mercy? Are you? Let me say this. Let's say you are praying to God about your wife, your husband, money problems, family problems, arguments, so on and so on. Let's say that you are looking to God to help you with any type of problem. So let's say that you are looking for mercy. Okay. Are you willing to show others mercy? Let's say a person cursed you out. And let's say the next day that person asks you for some juice. Are you willing to show that person mercy? Let's say that person asks you for a cheese sandwich. Are you willing to show that person mercy? Let's say that person needs a ride home after work. Are you willing to show that person mercy? Or are you willing to think in your mind or to say to that person, I am not going to help you because you did me wrong? Listen. If you are looking to God to show you mercy, how much more should you be merciful to others? <laughs> right? How can you ask God for something? How can you ask God, let's say you ask God for mercy. How can you ask God for mercy if you are not willing to show mercy to others? Please listen. So I believe what this scripture is saying, in my own words, if you are merciful, mercy, you will obtain mercy. I believe this goes with you reap what you sow. So if you want mercy, man, I believe you better be merciful to others, even if you believe you can't afford it, man. I need mercy. And I believe I am merciful to some. And I believe I am improving. So let me stop here. God bless you.